Hi everyone, it's Michelle, welcome back. Today I'm gonna be doing some super easy um, paper bag loaded envelopes. I had a request regarding this and I thought I would upload a tutorial. They're so easy, um, but I'm just gonna show you the way that I do it. So this little one here, which came out so cute, is measured, the bag size is measured at six and a half by four inches. So um, I use like some of my leftover simple stories that I have and I'm just going to try and get rid of that since I've used most of it. And this is the one that I'm going to be doing a tutorial on today. And this is uh, sized at eight and a half by five and three quarters. So it's a little bit bigger and uh, it gives you more tuck-ins, but I'm just showing you the size difference. But these are so easy and uh, I don't know, it might be fun just to watch to make if you already know how to do it. So uh, for my bag to keep a nice score, I like it to look clean. So for my eight and a half by five and three quarter bag, I like to score it at about three inch. And you obviously don't need to do this. You can absolutely eyeball uh, your bag and just fold it. But because I have already pre-cut my strips today, um, I thought it would be a good idea to go ahead and do that. So let me get rid of this scoreboard because I don't think I need it. So I've measured out my paper. If you're using this size bag, it's gonna be three inches by five and three quarters. So this is gonna fit perfectly on here. And at this point, what I did was sewed it on. So I'm going to do it the other way because not everyone may have a sewing machine. So I'm just going to go ahead and glue it down. But I like to sew it because you, you have like a two in one. You can put this on and um, seal this at the same time. And by the way, the collection I'm using today for fun, which I haven't really touched, is that bow bunny that I got from Tuesday morning. And I thought this is a good time to use it because I don't know what to do with it. And I slapped this on crooked. Sorry, guys. Let me just put this on again. Okay. And then I made another strip. My strip is one inch and a quarter by th five and three quarters. So here is the time you would want to cover that up. And you don't have to because some people like it to show that it's a brown bag. But instead of using a whole strip of paper, you don't need to do unless you want some stability on the back. So I'm just going to go ahead and glue that on right there. So you don't have to waste a lot of paper, you're just using a strip and it kind of gives that illusion that it's all the way down. Wow, I am so off, you guys, <laughs> on my uh, image today. Okay, so it looks like that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and glue my sides. This needs to stick for a minute. Um, I did, oh, oh gosh, you guys, my desk is so messy. I'm about to redo my room and I, I, I don't know what to do with my craft room. So I keep stalling it and I'm just gonna put on a little washi tape right here while that dries. Um, but I just keep stalling it because I see so many craft room ideas. And I don't know if many of you know this, but we are actually a military family. So um, we do own this house, but uh, we move and we will probably be moving again real soon within a year. And um, it's hard to make it like a home when you move around. So I have to be careful with our weight and all that kind of stuff because, you know, you're always moving. And then when you move to another house, you don't know if it's going to fit. Okay, so... Um, Okay, so there's that. And now's the fun part, the tuck-ins. 
So, um, sorry you guys, I have like a bad cough going on right now. Not a good time to have allergies <laughs> when <laughs> there's this virus going around. Okay, so let's see what we got in here. Oh, for I thought this was fun. I added a little brad right here just to put a little thing. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And this is how it looks so far. So you can see how easy and adorable that already looks. So let's see what Bow Bunny has to offer. I don't really use it too much. I know you. there's a lot of Bow Bunny fans out there. Oh, this would be really adorable to put if you wanted. Like right... Oh, I put that sticker there. I didn't see this in there, but... Or maybe even right here, like a little, oh, it fits perfect. Wow, okay. I think it's a sign that we have to add this on. Let's see how it goes. And I had these pockets that I haven't used. So I thought this would be a nice tuck in to do this. And then I'm going to find one to put my brad on. So I have these brads again that I got from Hobby Lobby. So I'm just gonna pick one out. And let me find a tag maybe, that would be ideal. I kinda like that one. These actually might be too big for my brad. So I might have to put something smaller on. Hold on, let me add some tuck-ins so you can see just how easy it is to make this pretty. Oh no, my envelope, I uh, put this on crooked, so just ignore that. And let me see what I can find because those holes are going to be too big for my little brad. Um, maybe I'll just do this leaf. So let me just go ahead and put a tiny little hole in it, or maybe not actually because that brad's small. So let me just stick this through. And then I'm just going to go ahead and this one I can absolutely make a little hole. here see that just adds a little oomph to it and let me see if I was gonna do this Let's get this out of the way for a minute then it ends up kind of looking like that file folder that I made but I'll go ahead and do it So yeah, you can make this any size you want. They're really easy to make. And I love the sewing part on it. Oh my, I am just all off on my measurements today. So just ignore the fact that it might be a little wobbly today. We all have those days, right? So let me cut that off, it was just a little bit bigger. And then I'll just add a couple more tuck-ins. But do you see how easy it is to make these loaded bags look just really pretty? Too easy, guys. And these are really pretty. So I wonder what this will look like on here. This big one is calling my name. That looks like it belongs there, doesn't it? Voila! So this is it. I am just gonna finish this off with a couple little things right here. See how it looks. And I think it came out really, really nice. Oh, I'm loving all this stuff. Maybe I'll put that right there. Where do I want this? Maybe right here? Or maybe not. Mm. 
and I don't think I like that there. <laughs> Let me see. This one's cute too. Ah, oh, that's better. Okay, so there you have it, you guys. My little loaded envelope. I literally did the same thing. This one's actually probably more prettier than uh, the previous one that I did. But I just thought you guys would like to join along. And here's the sizing for the other. Uh, just so you can see the size difference. But they still look adorable no matter what kind of bag you have. Thanks, you guys.